uh, you beat a very good hockey player and goaltender in Martin Berdour. What did you see? What did he give you? Uh, yeah, I was I was getting a little nervous. Um, he's a you know he's a Hall of Fame goaltender, so uh, that's a guy I've watched growing up for for a long long time. So um, you know I just knew he was giving a lot of the boys a glove, and, and uh, he's got a pretty good glove hand. So he wanted to shut that. He wanted you to shoot there and shut it down. So I just. Uh, you know, faked the backhand uh, glove upstairs and brought it across, and uh, thankfully a bit. And you've had plenty of practice this week. You had a shootout experience against Lake Erie on Wednesday. You were stopped in that one. Different move here tonight? Uh, yeah, that's, uh, you know, I tried something different in Lake Erie, and, um, you know, I think it was the right move, but the, with the goaltender made a nice save. But, uh, you know, I'm happy that's over with, and I'm happy uh, we got two points. Yeah, and talk about the day. You arrived at the hotel last night about 9.30, of course, after the call. Here you are back in the National Hockey League, and uh, this is certainly not a new experience for you. I imagine the butterflies were there for Ryan, but not yourself. Um, yeah, no, I, honest to God, I think they were there for both of us. Um, you know, especially coming into a, a new system with a um, you know, with new coach and, and uh, you know, just a lot of things changed. So, uh, you know, my heart, my heart was racing that whole first period, and I just kind of wanted to... Um, you know, fit in and make uh, you know all the all the right plays, and you know once I got that goal in the second, it's like uh, you know a lot of weight came off my shoulders, and I was just able to play hockey. So uh, thankful for that.